Welcome to the Ira A. Fulton Schools of Engineering at Arizona State University. Our college houses the undergraduate and graduate degree programs for engineering, computer science, and a majority of the technology programs that are offered at ASU. This presentation will explore the computer systems engineering degree program. ASU has four campuses that span the Phoenix metro area, and the Fulton Schools of Engineering are located on two of those, the Tempe campus and the Polytechnic campus. The Computer Systems Engineering degree program is located at the Tempe campus, but all campuses are open to all students regardless of where their program is located. We offer a free inter-campus shuttle for all our students so that they can explore courses, student orgs, activities, and resources at any campus. At Fulton, we offer 25 undergraduate degree programs, which provides a lot of choice and flexibility in finding the program that fits for you. We are called the Fulton Schools of Engineering because we categorize our degree programs into six schools, which are organized by theme and location. The first five schools from left to right are housed at the Tempe campus, and the Polytechnic School is housed at the Polytechnic campus. Our computer systems engineering students belong to the School of Computing, Informatics, and Decision Systems Engineering, which you will see towards the middle of the infographic. Each school has its own director, affiliated faculty, and advising unit so as to provide greater support and specific guidance to the students within that school. ASU and Fulton have direct admission, meaning when students apply, they apply directly to the degree program they want to pursue. As long as a student meets the admissions criteria for their program of interest, they are admitted. It is important to note that some of our degree programs, including computer systems engineering, have slightly higher admissions criteria than the general university requirements. For a comprehensive list of admissions criteria, you can visit the Fulton Schools of Engineering website at engineering.asu.edu. Students in the Computer Systems Engineering program are located at the Tempe campus, which is both their academic and residential home. First-year freshmen are expected to live on campus their first year, and our Computer Systems Engineering students are currently registering for housing in the Tooker House. Tooker House is the residential hall for all of the engineering and computer science disciplines, and we are also expanding to University House for the 2020-2021 academic year. Students that are a part of Barrett the Honors College live in Barrett Housing, but are given the opportunity to live on an engineering-specific floor if they choose. Computer systems engineers are the utility workers that work behind the scenes of every successful technical system. They serve as the bridge between the physical world and the digital world because they design the infrastructure that delivers the services of different applications. Computer systems engineers are critical because they understand how a technology fits into the larger scheme of society's needs. Computer systems engineers work on the interface between different pieces of hardware and strive to provide new capabilities for existing and new systems or products. They often find themselves focusing on engineering problems or challenges that result in new state-of-the-art products that integrate computing and communication capabilities. Computer systems engineers work on the developments, verification, and testing of computer hardware and software, from chips to device controllers and embedded systems. They learn the basics of logic design, microprocessor systems design, computer architecture and computing interfacing, while continuously focusing on systems requirements and design. They also focus on computer networks for the transmission of data and multimedia. A commonly asked question is how computer systems engineering is different from computer science. Computer scientists are the tool makers of the programming world, and they focus on the theory of programming rather than user-facing activities. Computer scientists write the core programming algorithms and behaviors that computer systems engineers apply to the user realm. Computer system engineers are employed in industry, government, education, and consulting, and are concerned with the design, development, and operation of hardware and software components of a computer's system. The guiding document for all majors is called the Major Map. This document can be found online on the SIDSI website, but what you see on the slide is a simplified version that shows you what courses you would take and the suggested order of when you would take them. All of the computing degrees involve a core programming component during the first year, so your first year experience in SIDSI is very similar across the different majors. Students in computer systems engineering begin with calculus and a course on principles of programming Java. 
The second year in this program involves further coursework in advanced programming and digital design. Your junior year is when you begin to take upper division coursework that is more specific to the major, such as design and synthesis of digital hardware, embedded microprocessor systems, and computing ethics. Your senior year includes courses on computer networks and computer architecture, along with two capstone courses. Providing resources for success is what ASU does best. One of our greatest resources is plentiful, free tutoring. We have our own tutoring center for SIDSI students. The center is available every day of the week and provides tutoring all the way into junior year classes. Our tutors are there to help support learning. These are high performing students that will help with general subject information, but also teach from the perspective of a student that recently experienced learning that topic. Another unique resource is our Fulton Career Center. This office provides career support for our students throughout their time at ASU. For SIDSI students, this starts their first semester. At the Career Exploration Night, our first year students have the opportunity to mix and mingle with industry leaders. They have the unique chance to tap into the knowledge of these professionals and get insight as they explore their majors. In SIDSI, we pride ourselves in our commitment to students and their success. To accomplish this, we have a team of first-year advisors ready to help students with the transition to the university. These advisors not only meet with students in our offices, but also visit students in their ASU 101 courses. The goal of this team is to provide student-centered support and advising. Hello there, my name is Robert Lattice. Um, I am a current sophomore at Arizona State University, majoring in computer systems engineering, electrical engineering in the IRA Fulton Schools of Engineering. Uh, I am on the Tempe campus in Arizona, and I am an out-of-state student, originally from a small town called Newburgh in Oregon. Just to get started, I'm going to let you know why I chose computer systems engineering specifically. Um, it was really because I wanted to go into a computer engineering field. I actually added it after I had begun my undergraduate studies, um, but I really wanted to tailor my education to a computer engineering field. Um, I wanted to know how computers worked, uh, both hardware and software, um, and computer systems engineering really allowed me to, allow, opened up a pathway to allow me to uh, further expand my knowledge on embedded systems and low level programming and things like that. Uh, some of the classes I'm look for, looking forward to within the major are CSC 320, Design and Synthesis of Digital Hardware, and in it, um, you learn a lot of HDLs or hardware description languages um, and different programmable devices. Um, so some of the things I really chose CSE for, um, but I'm also looking towards CSE 325, which is an embedded microprocessor systems class, um, where it just goes over like the basic concepts of digital systems design for embedded systems. Uh, and microprocessors. So that's something I'm really also looking forward to. I think is very, very exciting about uh, the computer systems major. Uh, on campus, I'm involved in quite a few things. Um, I am in Fulton Ambassadors, uh, which is a paraprofessional organization to um, help prospective students really discover the IRA Fulton Schools of Engineering um, and answer any questions they might have for that. I'm also involved in the Grand Challenge Scholars Program, which is GCSP. Uh, I am currently in FURY, which is the Fulton Undergraduate Research Initiative. I'm doing research with Dr. Michael Goral currently in photovoltaics. Uh, I'm also on a student project in EPICS, which is short for Engineering Projects and Community Service. We are currently designing a uh, board for visually impaired students that will allow them to navigate the internet. Um, and then finally, I'm also in Arizona State's Honors College, uh, Barrett, the Honors College. Uh, speaking of Barrett, the Honors College, uh, I plan on beginning my thesis for that within the next semester, and that will that will be on machine learning. So that's another another way I'm using some of the things I'm involved in um, with my major in order to tailor myself towards my degree goals. So machine learning is a really interesting application within the fields of both my majors, electrical engineering and computer systems engineering. 
um, and I'm simply using the Barrett thesis option in order to pursue that. Uh, so one important thing I wanted to leave you all with um, was that ASU will help you tailor your education towards your own goals. You can look at me. I began engineering, um, or I began my time at ASU in electrical engineering. I didn't hardly, never programmed before, didn't really know what that was, and now I'm double majoring in electrical and computer systems engineering and very excited about all my classes from computer architecture to programming to uh, advanced circuitry. So um, whatever you want to do with your education, Arizona State will help tailor that towards your own goals and give you a uh, very good opportunity and environment in order to achieve those goals in the future. So thank you for listening and have a good day. Thank you for taking this time to explore the Computer Systems Engineering program with the Ira A. Fulton Schools of Engineering. If you have any questions about applying to Fulton, please contact us at fultonschools at asu.edu. If you have any specific questions about the Computer Systems Engineering program, please contact us at cidse at asu.edu.